Okay, so we're back for more Mysteries of the Ancients. And I have my special guest with me, who is... Warfire, hello! He's with me, and we are having fun. Uh, I guess we should maybe get the game going here. <laughs> Just talk in the main menu. <laughs> we'll have a 20-minute chat at the main menu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think we could do that, actually. Totally. Uh, so we're going to go back here, and we're going to grab the little statuette here. No, to the to the left, to the left. Maybe to the left. Line the to the spot. left. No, oh, yeah. no, no, to the left. In there. No, click there again. Okay, what? Tell me where click to go. Click at the statue again. Yeah. Yes, and then you. Like, oh, this thing here. Yes. Oh, okay. I didn't even know what I was looking for. <laughs> uh, we, I did actually find the four uh, collectible thingy majiggy off camera, and I kind of stumbled across that. It was in the little house here. By this whack-a-mole game. I actually remember that. So, so yeah, shame on me for not showing that, but it was there and it was fun. Yeah. Now, what are we doing? <laughs> mm -hmm. We have ears. Should we do ears? <laughs> if we can, I don't know if we need glue, but. Oh, glue, schmoo. But see, that worked. All right, no glue. No glue needed. So, it looks like we have more head. That yeah, and a to... whole rabbit. <laughs> and a whole rabbit, yes. <laughs> the chopped up the ears, then the head, and then they're just, yeah, we'll take oh, them Oh, you know, it just made me think of Easter, and I wanted to ask you, how do you eat your Easter bunnies? Uh, uh we don't really eat the Easter bunny. <laughs> well, do you eat by the ears, by the feet, or do you just go right to the middle of it? I, I I guess you mean chocolate bunnies, and no, we don't have chocolate bunnies at all. No chocolate bunnies. No, wow. we just we just get egg with candy in it, and a sometimes a small present, and we have to uh, look for it outside <laughs> in the garden because it's hidden. Hopefully, it's not raining that day. Uh if it is, then it's hidden inside the house. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I'm trying to think if uh, I'm an ear guy or a foot guy. I, I don't know. <laughs> I think I'd just break the ears off and just eat them. <laughs> now, what do we have here? We have chalk. Uh, two, two chunks of chalk. We have a whistle and I guess... Oh, there we go. Now that's better. I can see the names of it. And a chunk of glass. Uh, what are we trying to do here? We're trying to get across, right? Um, yeah, and get the girl down, though I don't really know what we're going to do with her when we get her down out of the tower. So... I mean, if we've got chalk, there must be something we need to draw. Yeah. Okay, so I... let's go to the map here, because it's been a while since we've played this, so we might... The X is where you want to go. No, X? I'm just kidding. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> you, you did it right. No, 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 no. This is the lady or the girl in the tower, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, birdies! How come I don't remember <laughs> these birdies? Well, they don't remember you either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nah, that's not very nice at all. So now we have a brush. Is there a pony? We need to brush a pony or something. <laughs> uh, no. At us. Yeah. Oh, maybe we can brush this thing here. There we go. <laughs> no. Chalk? I don't know. <laughs> oh, we need to chalk it up. Wow, they did really well with the chalk bits. Yeah, I, I I presume we've seen a picture of this somewhere in the uh, game. Oh, so I'm doing this wrong? Because I think I just went over top the same color. Yeah. Colors for the eyes. Oh. Ah, there we go. We did it. I think. Yeah, I think we've seen a picture of that somewhere. Um. Is it in our journal, maybe? Uh, I don't know, but I'm I'm just like, oh, hello. I don't even know what this is. Uh, is this character info? I don't know. But Can you click them? It... Hello. It's like a movie, it looks like. You see how they've got little circles around them? Yeah. 
Huh. Jack's got all of them. Oh yeah, so he does. He was the owl. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. I, I guess it's like, you know, character info, basically. Yeah, I just, I thought there'd be a book or something, you know? Yeah. We've never touched that, apparently, because I don't recall that either. No, no, we, you clicked it once in the very beginning, when there, when there were no characters at all, and then we just ignored it. <laughs> well, if we don't need it, we don't need it. That's my story. Yeah. Stick and do it. So... I think you might want to do this one yellow instead of red. Now we have to pick eyes. Yeah. Just click randomly until it's the right one. It worked. Brute force! I mean, we totally know what we're doing. Mm hmm. Absolutely. Isn't this how you normally play games? <laughs> well, these games at least. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, we need more stuff. There was once a wolf here. So we have a glove. Why do we need a glove? Oh, see, there was the picture there of the. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And then there's one in the uh, window there, too, to the right. In here? Yeah. Yep. Oh, maybe we can get past these thorns. There we go. <laughs> With the brush. <laughs> Why not? It's totally <laughs> possible. Uh, I guess. Oh, oh, oh. Never mind. We're supposed to say yay, puzzle! Oh, it's a slider, too. Did you want to read this for everyone? Yep. Slide the stone tiles around to allow the green tile to exit the field. Tiles can only move along one axis. So what's your take on sliding puzzles? Random. You don't even... Uh... In the beginning, I just I just randomly, well, force it or whatever you want to call it, and then you start to realize what you have to do later. So I'm taking it, we have to do this three times. That yeah. Was way too easy. Yep. Yeah. Uh, well, this one's a little bit tougher. It's, I mean, you can move the green one backwards. I can move it backwards. I just like try all the possibilities. Yeah, because you can get that one up. I don't like the way they do the... No, that, that it looks kind of awkward. If you I have to... Drag it or something. Yeah. Ooh. It's interesting to see how they totally differ in how they implement the controls on this puzzle. Yeah, because it's a games. relatively standard puzzle. Yeah. But everyone has like different types of controls. Like sometimes you have to, like this, you have to like click an arrow all the time at the end, and some you can just slide them all the way and. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm actually kind of stuck here now that I think about this. Yeah, I can see that you're just doing the same <laughs> thing over and over. Because I can't get. Get those two down. There yeah. we go. Finally. The green one is free. Get that one all the way out of the way. Uh, oh, okay, we might have to... What do you... What? No, what? Wait. Oh. I think we're gonna have to get... No, no, because then you're just going back to the <laughs> So what does that do for me? Get these out of the way, maybe. I feel like this one needs to come down again. Uh, but... Uh, slide, yeah, up with that one and slide the other ones. And down with that one. And, yeah, go forward with the green one and then you can, like, move stuff back. Shape here. That 
was definitely the trickier one. The first one was took me like two moves. That one took me like <laughs> twenty. <laughs> really? All that for two little steps? All right. Well, I think at least we saved. You're the girl. going to find my mom and dad? Great! Oh my God, her Here, voice. I found this while I was in the tower. It's definitely a grown-up trying to pretend to be a girl. Aww. All the crows flew to the castle, so the path to my house should be clear. I'm going to hide there. Thanks. Fair enough. Let's uh, find out what we have up here. <laughs> yeah, I was a little worried. Like, what are we gonna do with a girl? Like, drag her around for the rest of the <laughs> yeah, game? Yeah, piggyback her all the way around. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, what do we got here? This is. Oh, yeah, Crazy. this is the way we do these puzzles. Uh, the, the handle thingy is um, below the blue box. Okay. No, I have to that, put it over there. Yeah, that probably goes there. The statuette goes there. The ballerina! Oh, there she is. Now we Ooh. have one of these. What do, they call, what do you call this thing? Oh, too bad. <laughs> I was just gonna say scraper. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Because sometimes I use different words for it, right? Uh, what else would they call it? Uh, I don't think. I want to, well, scraper, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. You don't say. I'm trying to, Ooh, think. I have to think about it. Okay, so what do we got here? Information. Ooh. Magic number 14. Swap numbers within each of the colored circles, I presume, until the sum in each sector equals 14. Okay, so this is math, so I'll let you go ahead. Tell me what to do here. Uh, no. <laughs> this is your area. No. <laughs> yes. Okay, so... Um. What about this one? Oh, that's 16. There's 14. Um. Mm, this is not going to work. Because that's 12, no. that's 15, that's 7, 13. Yeah. Good grief, <laughs> this is kind of crazy. So, if I make that one... Higher. Then I need to make this one lower. Now, what can we do here? 13. So this one has to go one higher. There we go. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, why can't I touch that? <laughs> yeah, I was just gonna say the same thing. <laughs> uh, oh, wait. We can maybe hammer time this thing. Red eye. Then we have a bow tie. Oh, it's a rune. Tie. Oh, it looks like a bow tie. What does that rune mean? Um, I think it was the letter X or something. Or, or the, the letter D. <laughs> the letter X. X or the letter D? No, wait, X is didn't exist then, I'm presuming. No, that was the letter D. And most runes. This is letter D in Awakening Rooms and Dragon Rooms, at least. I see. Well, we don't know what it is here, do we? Nope. Oh. All right. Well, that's bunny number two done. Uh, we still need, a, like you said, an entire bunny. <laughs> we got an owl mask like we're going to some fancy dress party. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to remember what we would be axing. Wood. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. We need to put statues there too. Ooh, what's this again? It's astrology signs. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> You're gonna have to have your lessons there. Well, I guess we need to look at our map because I don't. Oh, oh, maybe not. I'm not seeing anything here to do. Oops, I didn't mean up, to do that. Up, 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 up on the map. Hang on, hang on. Up. up. So we can go there, there we go. or there. Hmm. So much to do. What do you want to do? Ruins or tower? 
Wait, wait. <laughs> the ruins picture has oh. something red lying on the astrology stuff because it was oh, probably yeah. there from the beginning. <laughs> it's. I guess it shows the scene when it was like intact. We hadn't been there yet, rummaging around. Uh, <laughs> Wrecking the place. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, maybe this is where the axe goes. And then the owl. Wow, one swing. We are super strong. Uh oh. Oh, it's one of these puzzles. Is this where they can't touch or something? Yeah, they can't be neighbors. Return the owl, fox, and bear to the correct houses at the right side, and the birds to the left. Animals can't move within one space of a hostile animal. Hmm. I have a feeling this is going to be one of those ones that requires a bit of finesse. You usually do these pretty fast, though. Yeah. Don't move that again, because now you're just... No, I just, I was trying to see, because sometimes these puzzles don't allow you to go backwards, so that one clearly oh, okay. does. Um, nope, actually, nope, nope. Oh, okay, I was going to say it allows you, but clearly it doesn't. So how the hell am I supposed to do this? I guess i got to move it up, maybe. Uh, yeah. And then you have to move, continue moving, um... Yeah, move these things kind of... Yeah, Clockwise, or whatever you call it. Yeah, move those over there, and that one. Now you can move the owl in there. Still can't get the bear, though. Are you just putting the, the animals randomly on the right side, or do you actually know where they go? And the color, I'm assuming. Oh, yeah, okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> You're testing me, aren't you? Yep. Oh, I just realized that that's not going to be good. Shoot. And later, we're going to have astrology pop quiz! <laughs> no. <laughs> yes! Uh, I think I'm in trouble, uh, actually. That just, uh, you can move the fox. Well, what if, can I move this here? Nope. No. Nope. Move oh, the that's fox. Okay. Again. Yeah, got it. Uh, well, we'll get all these cravens back to their place. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's legit. I think we've invented a new animal. I know. We had health, right? Yeah, yeah, we had help. Whoa, it's a secret passage leading underground. And it's dark. And it's a butterfly. And it's still dark. <laughs> it's fiendishly difficult to get around in the dark. I better <laughs> fix this. <laughs> oh, it would have been awesome. Also, if you just went, it's dark, it's still dark, and then the game goes, it's fiendishly dark. <laughs> <laughs> what does fiendishly dark even mean? <laughs> that the darkness is kind of not welcoming. Mm, okay. Ooh, I think we need some fireflies. Do you remember where the fireflies might be? Uh, I don't even remember any fireflies. <laughs> okay, so it looks like we could be there. Oh, look, maybe over here. Aha, remember? Oh, now, yes. We've They'll tried just sort of fly in our jar for us, thank you for behaving, fireflies. Or we're kind of like scooping them up like they're in <laughs> water or something. Yep. That'll work. It has like footstep noises, which is kind of cool. <laughs> 